Well, maybe the third time is the charm for state senator and former governor Julian Carroll, who has pre-filed a bill that would allow sports wagering at horse tracks and off-track facilities. According to Senator Carroll, who's tried to get the bill passed in the last two sessions, several states have profited from passing similar bills, and he wants Kentucky to do the same. Alexa Helwick reports. Senator Julian Carroll says passing his latest sports wagering bill will add much needed revenue to fund education and the state's pension systems. Vince Gabbert, the vice president and COO of Keeneland, is on board with the idea. We're very supportive of it. We feel like that the more customers and the more attraction that we can bring people here and expose them to the races, especially with our casual fans, just gives us more opportunities to engage with those patrons. Gabbert has been working closely with lawmakers to try and get this bill passed. He says adding another thing to the racing experience could bring more people to the track. I think it would engage those fans throughout the day and allow them to stay longer, uh, catch them between races, especially in the fall when you have UK football going on and other SEC and ACC football for people to, to engage and wager on. Horse racing fans could come right here to Keeneland and place a bet on any sporting event. And if this proposed legislation does pass, it could generate generate millions of dollars for the state of Kentucky. We reached out to the Family Foundation of Kentucky for reaction to the bill and the Horse Racing Commission's oversight of sports wagering. Spokesperson Martin Cothran criticized the bill and sent us a statement which reads in part, quote, their plan is to put the very group that was recently exposed for its careless and corrupt practices regulating horse racing in charge of sports wagering. This is a recipe for corruption, end quote. Bill request 236 will be considered beginning in January. In Lexington, Alexa Helwig, LEX 18 News.